Kwekwede Senatorial District has drummed support for the President of the 10th Senate, Distinguished Senator Godzilla Babu, for a third term come 2027. They echoed the support while hosting a grand reception in honor of the Senate President, Senator Godzilla Babu, at Ikorekwene Township Stadium today. In his remarks, facilitator of the event and Minister of State's for Petroleum Resources, Obong Emim Ekwerekwerekwo, announced the total support of Ikorek Benin Senatorial District for Senator Akpabio by 2027, which was later seconded by the House member representing Ikorek Benin Oborokara Federal Constituency, Honorable Patrick Omo. Today, you are the Senate President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. 45 years after Joe Wires, nobody knows when it will come again. So the people of Akwaibom North Senatorial District has come all out to celebrate you today. I, Honorable Dr. Patrick, Patrick Kumo, representing the entire people of Ikorekpene, Esherudim, Oborokara Federal Constituency, in the 10th House of Representatives, I hereby second the motion Ably moved by Honorable Oboremem Ekwerikwekpo that His Excellency Senator Goswil Obot Akpabio should go to the Senate in 2027 all opposed. I hereby second. Echoing the support, Akukwanang and Paramount ruler of Etamepo, His Royal Majesty Amanamuko, noted that Senator Akpabio is a proud son of the soil and will receive the backing of primary constituents. I'm here representing Afen Gugwana to celebrate our illustrious son. Akum Fefenang has asked me to tell him that he is an epitome of perfection, of political perfection in a Kwaibom state. All of us have seen what you have done when you were the governor, when you were commissioner, and when you were the Senate uh, minority leader. Speaker of the House of Representatives, who was represented by his deputy, Right Honorable Benjamin Kalu, described Senator Pabu as a jinx breaker, while the deputy Senate President, Senator Jibrin Barao, lauded Senator Pabu for his uncommon achievements. My big brother, my friend, I call you the jinx breaker. And you know why I call you the jinx breaker? We went to where Nigeria has not gotten a space for 53 years, the IPU. It was in Angola. And when we heard that Nigeria has not been given a space to be among the leaders of the Inter-Parliamentary Union for 53 years, you and I decided that you are the most fitted. He has formed alliance with all parts of Nigeria to help, first of all, to help the people of Ikotenekwene Senatorial District, Akwaibon, not where Senatorial District, and he's doing very well in that regard. He's also doing very well to help to bring prosperity to the entire Akwa Ibon state. Governor Moino, while reaffirming his commitment to upholding peace in Akwa Ibon state, solicited the support of Senator Fabio and citizens of Ikorek Pene Senatorial District. This is the statement Ikorek Pene and indeed Akwa Ibon state have made today. That we value you at home. We appreciate God for what God has done for the entire Kwaibom people. The ascension to becoming the Senate President from Kwaibom is a celebration for all of us. It is my determined and avowed commitment that as a Kwaibomite, 
we will continue to celebrate all our sons and daughters that God has raised in their various fields of endeavors. And I believe that this award is an endorsement that the Correct Parents Senatorial District will support the candidacy and the governorship of Pastor Umar Basieno for another eight years. On his part, the President of the 10th Senate, Senator Gautla Pabio, appreciated his constituents for their support while pledging to work together with the federal government to provide infrastructures in a quite boom state, including the Ibom Deep Sea Port. Today, you are wishing that your father gives you bread. It is bread that you shall have. Am I not the man that turned boys into men? Am I not that man? Am I not the person that gave you, gave you the first international airport? Am I not the man that gave you the first flyover? Am I not the man that gave you the first digital government house? Am I not the one that gave you the best deputy governor's lodge in Nigeria? Am I not the man that gave you the best governor's office in Nigeria? Am I not that man that gave you the best dualized roads in Nigeria? Am I not that man that gave you the best international stadium in West Africa? I'm not reporting for duty. You send me to go for duties on your behalf. I will never forget the uncommon love that you have for me. As you have loved me, I also love you. I love you. And God will continue to love you. Imagine the governor of Kwaibom said, inviting me to government house with my colleagues to pay because the call. Your Excellency, I don't take it for granted. The event was widely attended by dignitaries in and out of Akwaibum, including members of the National Assembly and the State Executive Council.